How are you? I'm good. good. So, uh, Megan Brown, Cody Deal. Uh, so, guess what? I had a chance. Can I have you speak real quick? Mark, I got my mic's off. Alright, so uh, Megan Rath, Cody Deal. Um, so, guess what? I got to speak to her brother, Jesse, yesterday. Ah. Didn't know you had a brother. Yeah. Found that out. Um, and he plays uh, on the Sci Fi Network for, on Defiance. Yeah. Um, and I have to admit, um, you're just oh, going into a lot more attractive than that. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyway, is it kind of weird having a sibling on like the same network? Is that kind of like. Yeah. Weird? Yeah. I mean, it's not weird. But it's just it's funny how things turn out because we've always sort of been fans of the genre, especially him, and uh, it's just like it's weird that we have two shows. We each have a show on the network, and Defiant sort of took over our time slot when our show finished. So no, no, that's great. No, he was a cool guy. Cool guy. Um, so we'll back to you. So um, last season, you had some like pretty emotional moments. Um, you really like brought it, to, you know, like with um, you bringing the kid back to life with you, and then him dying, and then um, when you um, with with the little kid when you well you you, you, you became human last yeah. season, right? And you brought you brought a, like, a boy with you, right? You did? The kid that had to hang himself because he oh, hit his family. Oh, Stevie. Okay. I, I don't remember his name. Okay. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. yeah. I was, I was, when you said kid, I was imagining like a child. Like, no. Because he's grown so much. Okay, yeah. gotcha. You just gotcha. get really worried there. You're like, what? Yeah, I'm like, <laughs> sorry. I, I, I think I remember. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, no. It's a long time ago. <laughs> no, it's, no, I bet. Yeah, filming and then, you know, talking about it. But anyway, uh, there was, you know, just as an actor and to an actor, I mean, you, you really brought it. I mean, oh, that thanks. was really amazing. And, um, and then your own death was very emotional. Like, and, um, you know, I just. I'm wondering, like, what do you do to, like, prepare for something like that? I mean, um, like, a lot. Like, I think about it a lot, and, you know, it's like after now four years playing the same character, you sort of identify with their struggle and sort of try to personalize it in some way. But, yeah, it's, 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 it's easy when you have very generous actors in that to give you what you need. And yeah, yeah. You, um, yeah, you have a lot of good chemistry with a lot of the cast. Right? Yeah. Um, okay, well, lastly, because I know you're on the line here, um, what can we expect from, from your character in uh, the seventh season? Um, you can ex expect, well, she's absorbed quite a bit of Donna's power um, through everything that they've been through, through together. They're connected, they're tied, and so they have, they share this common thing, and Sally's sort of trying to understand how to harness it. Um, so she's quite different in a sense, uh, and she's also been through so much emotionally that she. But you know what I like about her is like she has this amazing ability to project and, and mask, and so there's always sort of a lightness that comes out of her, even though terrible, terrible things. <laughs> for sure. Well, high five for being at Comic Con, and uh, always great seeing you. You too. All right. <laughs>